Hi, welcome to this episode of The Mitchell File. I'm your host, Roosevelt Mitchell III. A pair of lunch ladies in one of Connecticut's richest towns skimmed nearly a half a million dollars from the cafeteria in roughly a five-year time period, and cops believe that they were looting the schools for even longer, uh, stated the officials. According to cops, sisters Joanne Pascarelli and Marie Wilson, who were employed at Saks Middle School and New Canaan High School, respectively, stole approximately $478,588 between 2012 and 2017. Cafeteria cashiers told cops that the duo who oversaw the lunchrooms at the schools ordered them not to tally each day's take in at the register, but instead let them count it up and log the funds. The sisters would then allegedly underreport the earnings and pocket the difference. <laughs> wow. <laughs> but they skimmed so much off the top that the logs for some registers showed no cash at all for every day the entire school year. The heist uncovered by school officials probing an unrelated accounting discrepancy. And it may actually run as far back as 15 years, but the sisters were only charged for five due to the statutes of limitations, according to police. They are both charged with larceny and were released on $50,000 bail apiece. Wow, $500,000, a half a million dollars working in the school cafeteria off the top. That's a whole lot of money, but I would love to hear what you think about this. So please leave a comment in the section below. And until next time, my friends, be blessed and be encouraged.